All right, welcome back to the second take of this video. Gee whiz, I figured you didn't want to see the bathroom in the background, so I've closed the door. Uh, okay, look, let's, let's, uh, I'm, I'm going to stop whining now. Um, the last one was a little, little video was a little whiny. All these units over here, I had uh, swept them around this side, uh, came in from behind and... Jolly well had a nice old time beating up on the Brits, uh, the South, South Africans here. And, uh, you know, it wasn't very pretty. Uh, so what I had done wrong is not read rule 16.1 correctly. My fault. Uh, fuck. So... Basically, without me reading the rule to you, basically all this bullshit that uh, is was sitting in this hex here, which is its setup hex, there's a condition to the rule that says, hey, you set them up there or you set them up in or adjacent to any other unit from its formation. Boom. So... There's that, which is nice. This will apply to these uh, army, eighth army assets as well, I assume. And I assume that these eighth army assets can go anywhere because they're eighth army. And that would mean that any of their subordinate elements could receive one of those units. That's kind of how I'm reading that nonsense. Uh, which is all good. And then, of course, these little knuckleheads down here, 50th. Uh, I guess, uh, you know, I guess we've got to allocate them as well. Now, the good news is I haven't got too far with the game yet, so we haven't foobarred it as much as I thought. 50th is uh, deployed here. You can just... It goes down to there. So it's not going to affect this this larger movement of units here that I'd already done with my seven, let's call them free activations with triple movement to replicate repl blah, 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 replicate Rommel's uh, sneaky movement. Now, what I did differently is I didn't go all the way end around uh, to the south of Bir al-Hakim. I, uh, I uh, sent one division uh, with an HQ nearby uh, with infantry unit to breach that hex and then I sent the next division through and breached a hex uh, here, hex side here and that allowed us then to bring 15th, 21st and 90th through along with uh, various other help, uh, parts of I think that's 101st I can't see because my eyes are shit my eyes have just taken absolute hard core, like a core dump uh, in the last three weeks I can't see crap anymore so I've got to go to the optometrist um, I haven't used my phone to see pretty much uh, these these uh, these fonts. These these fonts are if given that they're important. That's one thing. Other criticism I will lay here uh, that that uh, higher echelon formation identifier needs to be bigger. Uh, it's it's annoying me. These are large counters, and I can't really read it very well uh, most days, <laughs> unless I have all the lights on. Uh, all right, the important point here is that, I'm gonna just move the camera up here and try not to knock guys over, uh, that I, I messed up allocating these and we need to create a heavy EZOC, enemy zone, uh, 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 a heavy zone of control here so that this end around nonsense can't happen. Uh, and that will reinforce that particular unit here. So I could take, I don't know, I could take an AT guy. That'll give him nine. What's a heavy ESOC? 12 or more? I think it is. Yeah. I oh, know. Yeah, 12 or more stacking points. So I only need 12 there. Eesh. I guess I could do, well, we'll work that out, but uh, that would do it, I guess. Something like that. I could always also use these guys. We could pull the artillery back do something like that and then put one of these guys up here who knows anyway uh, I'll fix all that um, annoying annoying mistake a little uh, a little nuance of detail that I missed now I will say uh, 
and I, I, that's just it's a minor criticism. If you're going to have examples uh, of these types of setup situations, what would have been helpful to me, and I know there probably wasn't some, there's no Vassal module for this yet, uh, so they couldn't have created a thing in Vassal, but shoot, have someone create something. But this this example, you know, you just I just read in it, and it's just it's a little word salad thing. And then the next example for multi-hex setup zones, it's huge. And quite frankly, I'm just glazing over it. I'm tired. I'm doing this at either six o'clock in the morning or 11 o'clock at night. And uh, I, uh, I would, you know, a little picture <laughs> would have gone a long way to helping me catch that, even though it is very clearly stated in the freaking rules. I just missed it. All right. That's my little whiny ass bitch mode for the morning. Have a nice day.